الرحیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اقرا بسم ربک اللہ ذی خلق خلق الانسان من علق اقرا و ربک الاکرم اللہ ذی علم بالقلم علم الانسان ما علم یعلم کلا ان الانسان ویتغا الرعاہ سہنا صدق اللہ العدیو العظیم لیکن نمبر 25 فار دا نائنٹ کلاس and uh, very good news uh, first session finished and the uh, papers uh, i have checked and those papers were up to the mark uh, the papers uh, the way you have solved uh, without attending physical classes ninth class the papers were good and uh, i was quite satisfied so lecture number 25 we are starting today second session and in the second session this session is a uh, indispensable important due to important uh, chapters and especially the chapters which are going to start now that is structure of cell organelles the structure of the cell and organelle is the chapter which I, I am going to start today and today my topic will be cell wall cell wall is the topic cell wall you know if you are ha not hard like plant and plants are hard animals are soft sometimes you feel that when you touch the stem of the plant the woody stem of the plant that is too much hard when you cut the stem of the plant with the knife it's you it's very difficult to cut but when uh, your skin is very soft injured by any sharp uh, object so why your skin is soft and why the stem is hard the reason because the plant has a cell wall. Cell wall is present in the plant cell and cell wall is absent in the animal cell. So outermost covering technically should be the cell membrane. But in the case of the animal cell, the outermost covering is the cell membrane. In the case of the plant, outermost covering is the cell wall. Question is cell membrane is not present in the, in the plant cell. No, that is present. That is present. If you see, I draw the structure of both cells, you will see that and this is the structure of the plant cell for example this is the outermost covering and this is the cell wall this is the cell wall this is the cell wall now i draw the structure of animal cell the animal cell structure is that it has two layers two layers outside the one layer which is the outermost layer which i will tell you this is the outermost layer that is the that is the cell wall and inner to the cell wall that is the cell membrane so I am talking about the plant cell now. Plant cell in the membrane, this is the cell membrane, and that is the cell wall. You got the idea why the plants are hard. Plants are hard because they consist of cell wall. And cell wall is the hard structure because that is composed of cellulose. What is the cellulose? Spelling of cellulose, students, C-E-L-L-U-L-O-S-E, cellulose. Cellulose is complex, complex carbohydrate. The complex carbohydrate. You know, I was naming uh, sugar molecules. You use the sugar, sucrose, sugar, glucose molecule so many times. That's the simple sugar. That is simple sugar. And cellulose is complex carbohydrate. Complex carbohydrate. A, 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 a carbohydrate which is found by the combination of the small, small carbohydrate molecule, simple carbohydrate molecule. When small carbohydrate molecules will combine to form the complex carbohydrate molecule, the process is called as a condensational polymerization. When small molecules combine to form the large molecule, the process is called condensational polymerization. So today, topic is the cell wall. What is the cell wall? Cell wall is the outermost covering of the plant cell. Why it is present in the plant cell? Because you know, plant has no protective system. But it is not present in the human body. Human body has a protective system. If you talk about the protective system of the human body, you have a bones type structure, bone type structure, that is a skeletal system. You have a skeletal system. Your bones which are present in your body, that are the bones are the part of the skeletal system. But in case of the plant, cell wall is present. Cell wall is almost a skeleton, which is a protective system in the protective system in the plant cell. So plant cell are protected by the cell wall. Why they are protected by the cell wall? Cell wall composed of a organic a complex organic molecule. The composition of the complex organic molecule is cellulose. C E double L U L O S C. I will tell you now. Now I will not talk about animal. I will talk about only cell wall now. Cell wall is present in the plant cell, but some plant cells consist of two cell walls, and some plant cells consist of only one cell wall. 
सो इट मीन दैट आई एम क्लासीफाइंग प्लांट्स ऑन टू टाइप्स सम प्लांट्स विथ टू सेल वॉल सम प्लांट्स विद वन सेल वॉल द प्लांट्स विथ टू सेल वॉल्स विच आई विल टेल यू दैट प्लांट आर नेम्ड देयर नेम स्पेसिफिक नेम इज देयर आई एम नॉट नेमिंग नाउ बिकॉज यू विल बी कन्फ्यूज इन दिस चैप्टर इन द लास्ट टॉपिक्स आई विल डिस्कलोज द आंसर ऑफ दिज टाइप ऑफ द प्लांट सेल विच विद द टू सेल वॉल एंड द प्लांट सेल्स विद द वन सेल वॉल बट नाउ यू विल अंडरस्टैंड ओनली दैट थिंग दैट सम प्लांट सेल्स some plant cells have one cell wall some plant cells have two cell walls have two cell walls and cell wall if two cell walls are present that is composed of primary cell wall and the secondary cell wall and the secondary cell wall if the cell wall present two cell walls present mean the plant cell the type of the plant cell with the two cell walls they consist of two type of the cell walls one is a primary cell wall and one is a secondary cell wall now another thing secondary cell wall is inside secondary cell wall is inside primary cell wall is outside so i have classified the plants into two groups one the plants with the only primary cell wall yes and one type of the plant with the two cell walls with the primary as well as the secondary cell wall with the primary cell wall as well as the secondary cell wall and we know that primary and the secondary cell wall composition is a different mean their composition the main wall of the plant that is the primary cell wall the main wall of the plant cell that is the primary cell wall mean that's why i am talking about where anybody ask from you what is the composition of the cell wall now you will be thinking that you sir you are asking about the composition of the primary cell wall or you are asking about the composition of the secondary cell wall what the answer you will give you will give the answer that the primary cell wall the primary cell wall composed of cellulose mean any question asked from you about the cell wall composition the examiner is asking about the primary cell wall because that is the main cell wall that's why it is called the primary cell wall the secondary cell wall is not present in all cells in some limited number of the cell the reason i will tell you in the last last of the topic in the last of this chapter so primary cell wall and the secondary cell wall now the question is sir what is the composition of the secondary cell wall of course the composition of the secondary cell wall is lignin l i g n i n sir why you are telling cellulose cellulose again and again and you did not speak the lignin much lignin much reason because the main cell wall of the plant is the cellul is cellulose primary cell wall secondary cell wall only present in extraordinary case in some cells which i will explain so if there are two cell walls if there are two cell walls if there are two cell walls they will be like that outer layer that will be the primary cell wall and inner layer that will be the secondary cell wall primary cell wall this one this is the secondary cell wall and inner to the cell membrane so three layers in some plant cells in which the secondary cell wall is present sir so lignin is a hard or cellulose is hard lignin is more hard cellulose is not much hard that's that is a man of the main reason that this is present in some plant cells because plant cells in which the secondary cell wall is present mean that is composed of the lignin they will not survive and they will die those plant will die because those plants will die reason is that because that they consist of the lignin very hard chemical substance lignin do not allow the movement of the molecule from outside to inside so what will happen the cell wall cell wall composed of cellulose cell wall present in the plant cell that the point i am talking to you in this lecture the secondary cell wall the secondary cell wall present in some plant not present in all plant present in some plant in which plant i have to tell so the fun will tell in the coming lectures when the time will come in this chapter i will tell you because you are in a junior class we we'll go back to another thing which is about the bacteria bacteria so bacteria consist of cell wall so bacteria is a plant because bacteria consist of cell wall no bacteria is not the plant bacteria is a prokaryote bacteria is a prokaryote bacteria is not the plant so sir why the bacteria consist of cell uh, consist of cell wall and how you will not relate the bacteria with the plant bacteria cannot be plant because bacterial cell wall is not composed of cellulose you are watching the you are watching the word here which is written here very important word will come in your objective type in your paper peptidoglycan the peptidoglycan p e p t i d o g l y c a n peptidoglycan this is a conjugated molecule this is a conjugated molecule when molecule consists of two small organic molecule two small organic molecules will combine that is the conjugated molecule 
that is the conjugated molecule so small molecules will combine that is the conjugated molecule so they are composed of conjugated molecules what is the conjugated molecule two small organic molecules combine and that will be called as a conjugated molecules so what is what is the happening here bacterial cell wall composed of a term which is called as peptidoglycan two molecules together mean one is a peptide one is a glycan mean this is a protein and carbohydrate protein and carbohydrate okay ji it complex of amino acid and sugar amino acid mean amino acid mean protein you know protein composed of small molecules called as amino acid protein composed of small molecules and protein is a polymer and small molecules which combine to form the protein that is the amino acid and we go back to next one that is present in the peptidoglycan that is the sugar that is the sugar sugar mean the glucose mean the carbohydrate so carbohydrate and the protein protein in the form of amino acid carbohydrate in the form of the sugar carbohydrate in the form of the sugar sugar plus protein sugar plus protein amino acid and sugar they will combine to form which structure which structure that is the peptidoglycan that is the peptidoglycan why we are studying peptidoglycan here because that molecule is present in the cell wall of the bacteria why we are giving importance to composition of the cell wall of the bacteria because bacteria is not the plant we are making distinguish we are making distinction between the cell wall of the bacteria and the cell wall of the plant cell wall of the plant composed of cellulose the main cell wall mean primary cell wall and the cell wall of the bacteria is composed of a peptidoglycan you cannot say that bacteria is the plant the bacteria belongs to different group bacteria belongs to prokaryote and bacteria is showing i am different how it is showing because its cell wall composed of peptidoglycan we we'll go back to another point which is significantly important fungal cell wall composed of cellulose fungal cell wall composed of chitin fungal cell wall composed of the chitin so three things living things fungal fungus fungus and the bacteria and the plant fungal cell wall is composed of chitin fungal cell wall composed of the chitin why fungi is not the plant i was teaching in the last chapter that fungi is, did not uh, digest in the kingdom plant a reason fungal cell wall composed of chitin not composed of the cellulose so competition between three living things i am plant plant says i am plant because i am composed of cellulose bacteria say i am not a plant because i am composed of the peptidoglycan fungal say i am not plant i am not bacteria my cell wall composed of the chitin so i will continue students and this was lecture number 25 i hope you will revise this one thank you very much